Mm -hmm. Andrew on John. I'm all just sharpening in pencils. Wow. Welcome to Campbell's Corner. Well, what is the snack <sighs> this week? Let's get right into it. You know, the snack is definitely not the inspiration. Is that right? That is right. I have to turn the audio on because I didn't check before we went. Live. I did turn. I'm a good person. You're so on top of it. I'm right, responsible. Here. Totally prepared. Today's snacks are brought to you by Turkey. Don't ask why, but these because are from Turkey. Universal Yums. Lush Mosaic Cocoa Cream Cookies and... I will let you try oh. to pronounce this. Miniki Turktakik. Yeah. So that's a staple in every Turkish that's household. That's what's happening. So, but we put them in a pretty bowl, so it's better. Kimball, cicadas. Do yes, you love them? I do not. So if you live in the Northeast. Let's look at one together. Oh, see, even just looking at it freaks me out. What if I zoom in, though? Does that help a little bit? No. Just take up the whole screen. I just look away. I look away. Get closer so, to it. Okay. If you live in the Northeast U.S., oh my lord, he's huge. <laughs> um, you know that the 17-year Brood X cicadas are are coming out in full, and it's even free if you don't live over here, you probably know about it, right? And it, it, like, I'm terrified of bugs and spiders of all kinds. These are huge, flying, scary things. I don't care if they don't hurt you; they are terrifying. So that's what I'm dealing with right now. Nice. And. Um, I literally, there was one in front of the car door today. I couldn't get in the car until Rocky moved it. Yeah, that's how terrified I was. I was like, I can do this. No, I can't. Mm -mm. They're terrifying. I cannot see so, comments on the thing. How do I do that? I don't know. Maybe nobody's, maybe nobody's here. No, they're here. There's five oh, people. We're not seeing comments. I don't know why. I'll figure it out. Whatever. Maybe he will. Maybe he won't. Anyway. This is going to be the inspiration for today's piece. At first, I was like, yeah, I'm going to draw my fears and really overcome. And as I was looking for pictures, no. <laughs> I, like and we went for a drive and i saw them like by the hundreds on trees and on in the streets and my oh i was getting all clammy and sweaty and disgusting and i was like inside of a car <laughs> so whatever i don't know why i'm drawing this but i said i would draw something in this journal let's get to it your indiana jones journal yeah oh, i'm out of breath because i'm freaked out because i forgot Just I was... remember kimball don't rush well also i forgot i was going live because i was talking with my mom on the phone i was like oh by the way mom i have to go because i'm going live in like 10 minutes so, you know, totally prepared. Now everyone understands. Mm -hmm, mm hmm And up to speed. So. All right, we'll get into it, Kimball. Obviously, we're drawing gigantic red scary eyeballs. Ugh. Why do I do this to myself? All right, so I pulled up comments on my phone because they're not showing up on our thing. So it looks like we who's who's on? It looks like uh, Denise is on. Hey, Denise. Elaine. Hey, Jenna. Elaine. Hey, Jenna. Trisha. Hey, Trish. And Dolores is on. Hello. Dolores, how's it going? I don't know what Jenna's saying. They're two, <sighs> three inches. That could be anything, but I'm not sure. No. Oh, the cicadas, would, probably. I'm assuming she's talking about cicadas. This is a PG family friendly channel. Uh, PG 13 ish. All right, cool. Okay, so eyes. Thems are things. So wait, oh. so what is the whole motivation? Like, how are you going to transform that thing into a person? Well, I'm already drawing it far about? too big, but okay. Uh, I was going to draw like the wings as oh, blah, 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 as earrings. <laughs> They're going to be ear wings. Wait, let me feel your hands. Are they clammy? They're cold and slightly clammy. It's like you're going to get a shot at the doctor. Yeah, like I'm sure my heart rate is up just a wee bit. I was coming back. We, they've been pretty docile to this point, but I was bringing groceries back and one like full on attacked me on the way mm. into the house. So mm -hmm. I told Kimball mm -hmm. about it and he's not going outside again. Yep. Oh, so far that I'm, I'm, I'm so scared that I'm canceling my dentist appointment because <laughs> <laughs> I am not walking through that nightmare. Okay, we're just going to give her a human nose. Perfect. Oh, it's a little too big because her eyes are ginormous because their eyes are huge. Oh, little, little. You know, we have that Patrick Stewart meme where he's like acting. Yes. We should have one that for, we should get, find someone who's like, art. <laughs> Arting. Someone said they're colorful. See, someone's looking on the bright side. Yeah, they are. Trisha. They are colorful. That way you can see them coming. Kimbra says, I love that sketchbook. I know, right? Gorgeous. <laughs> It wasn't even that expensive for what it is. I mean, it's super chunk and thick. The only thing that's kind of weird about it is it's literally charred edges. So the charcoal like, or the, yeah. the edges come off on your hand. Yeah. Okay. I don't know what this uh, mouth looks like. I mean, they live off tree roots. So. I would say it's at a very attractive mouth. Should I give, oh, I'm going to give a slightly parted lips. They're, they don't bite though. So I know that. 
So <laughs> Elaine's like, maybe we should have stuck with the mermaid. mermaid. I know, right? Oh, these only come around every 17 years. Here, eat a snack. Can't believe it feel better. Okay. <laughs> Still well, honey, have another chocolate bar. <laughs> <laughs> if you missed out, the snacks are all from Turkey today. Elaine's all not insect season. Mm. Carrie says, "Scary, <laughs> Carrie, Carrie says you're so brave, Kimball. Thank you, thank you. <laughs> mm. Like, oh man, people snack on these. Like, who, who's like, oh, that looks tasty. Let's put that in my mouth. I hope it clings onto my tongue. Kimball, they are the shrimp of the earth. No, they're giant cockroaches. I never sent a bad experience at Panda Express. I'm not into shrimp anymore." Ever since that bad experience at that restaurant in Texas where the cockroaches were flying around the room. Oh, it stubs? Yeah. And everyone's like, eh, whatever. I'm like, no, that cockroach was like bigger than my finger. Like it was like that big. And it was scuttling across, like flying from picture to picture. Oh, I'm getting all sweaty. <laughs> Face your fears, Kimball. Uh, I want you. Okay. You were so ugly, no offense. You were so ugly. Well, she's cute, though, when you're drawing. Yeah, we'll see how she turns out. She's going to be creepy, too. I was talking to my dad about um, the old show Fear Factor and how he was saying he would, like, do anything. Like, he'd cross, like, the tie rope and all that, but he would not eat insects. I'm like, I'm on the same page. I would not eat any any insects whatsoever. Mm -mm. They kind of have round faces, right? Ugh. Sure, why not? I mean, it's you're making a person out of it, so it's really whatever you want. Right, but I wanted to, like, take some of the cues. Oh, what, you're giving her antennas or what? Small cheek. Well, I'm going to give her just one giant lash on each side. Nice. You know, just, it's it's not a direct... Jenna says in Texas there are flying roaches, um, and they find their way into the house in the summer. No, see, that's... No, I'm not visiting. Oh, hell no. Kimber <laughs> says that in Pensacola, the palmetto roaches fall out of the tree when you walk al when you walk along. Thank you for the heads up. Not visiting. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, if you ever want Kimball to visit where you're at, don't give him any bug stories. Oh, man. Uh-uh. I know. I was like, I wanted to go to Australia just to go to the JDHQ when they have their classes again. But, I mean, if you watch Jane's Live and, like, there was one, and she, there was, like, the spider the size of, like, my phone on her wall. And she's like, we'll just get it later. I'm like, no, you get that. Now. Kimball's like, don't take your eyes off of it until it's dead. I know. And then she was like, I don't know where it went. I'm like, excuse me. <laughs> like, that's... It went in your pillow or inside your pant pocket. And, like, on occasion, there'll be, like, a bug just, like, in her art supplies. Anyway, I'm going to use the wing. Oh. You can do it, Campbell. Come on. Okay, they're going to be... Mm. Oh, there's two. I keep forgetting there's two of them. I'm like, why does it look so weird? Jenna says they have cicadas every summer, and that's her like roundabout way of saying get over it, Campbell. It's like, once every seven. We years. have cicadas every summer, too, but not in the trillions. That's what I'm getting at. <laughs> like, last summer, hundreds. <laughs> hundreds is fine. <laughs> trillions? And we're in the epicenter of this whole magic phenomenon. <laughs> If anyone's wondering, yes, it is as amusing to live with them during this time as you might imagine. It's like, it's funny how scared I am of them, but then like, it's not funny when one comes after me because I go running. Well, the best part is we go on drives and Kimball looks out the window like he's looking at mass murderers eyeing him. You have no idea. Like he can't not like, look. He's like, he has to know where they all are at all times. And, oh, uh, like, no, I'm, whatever. I'm all sweaty now. This is gross. <laughs> Just remember you chose the theme. I know, because I thought, oh, if I look at it more, I'll be better with it. But it's just making it worse. Elaine says she's just going to hang out in the UK and worry about pollen. <laughs> <laughs> right? <laughs> Honey, I'm with you. Like, we need to move to cold. That's why I, I don't like summer at all. Like, no summer. Like when I used to own a Saturn. It had, like, a, a moon roof. Not a sunroof, but a moon roof. Kimber saw a spider on the dash once, and he jumped out the top of I, the damn moon roof as it was we're closed. driving on the freeway. It was closed. Not any longer. And he broke right through oh, it. Oh, it busted. It busted. And then and cut to two years later, my sister's in the back seat and it's been raining and all this water just pours, <laughs> like all this freezing water from winter storm pours on it's her. It's not my fault. Oh mm -hmm. my God. Good times. Mm. Yet as a child, was not scared of bugs at all. But as I grew up and educated myself about them and how all they can do these disgusting things, mm. they became more and more scary. Scarier and scarier. Whatever. Anyway, I thought, let's draw the legs as a necklace. Yeah, that sounds great. Mm. Don't forget to get the shape right. It's like little boots. Look. <laughs> well, I'm just going to draw the thigh but Look, parts. it's like little boop. No, we're not going. But look how close it is, Kim. No, see, that makes it, it's going to be like, yeah, I'm How do you think you. it crawls up the trees? That's how it has a little spiky. Yeah. Here, I'll get, I'll keep it close right there for you. Cool. 
just like why okay i'll leave you alone sorry not you the bug why like why i'm not even mad at them i'm mad at how scared i am of them like but they're I, so pretty like orange is one of your favorite colors and navy, like dark navy blue i'm sorry if an orange monster comes running down the street i'm not gonna run up to hug it thank you <laughs> <laughs> you can die oh you're so pretty <laughs> as i'm running away you're so pretty don't kill me okay, well, so okay. Mm -hmm. I need my sugar. don't rush it kimball I'm not. Kim has a habit of like rushing through his lives and then he's like, oh, it's only been 30 minutes. What else am I going to do? <laughs> and he's like, I just need to take more time. Those snacks are weird. They're from Turkey. Yeah, that was a were delicious. They're like very processed snacks though. I had the tahini one. That was really good. Was it? I mean, it was interesting. I feel like I was eating I like a trade peanut. I'm sorry. Remember when you had your banana thing? <laughs> Whatever. Mm, it's gross bananas. Bananas are gross. Actually, bananas taste fine. They smell gross. Bla uh, says in Australia, they got to worry about tons of critters and venomous animals. That's like the one reason we're not yeah, going to visit right like, now. Like, that's why it's not on my top 80 list of and places to visit. Jenna tried to do a nice pivot to how was everyone's week? <laughs> <laughs> you know, it was good until the cicadas came out. So, yes, how's there? Is anyone doing anything interesting tonight, by the way? I'm drawing my fears. And spitting on my book as Dude, I talk. Let's talk about everyone's fears. That'll because that's this is Kimball's tackling his fear right now. What is your biggest fear that's appropriate for the comment section? <laughs> They're like, what is my biggest fear? I wonder. That this conversation will never end. My biggest fear is that the conversation will never end. <laughs> this one. Oh, gotcha. Are the people watching? They're like, can we can we just can we get on with the art? What is my biggest fear? Losing I'm so bad me. At these games, probably. I mean, that's like my second biggest fear. <laughs> <laughs> I was telling Kimball that if he was in Indiana Jones and the Temple of Doom and he had that scene where he has to like Indy. reach his hand through the insects to like save us oh, from the I'm, like, I'm sorry, babe. <laughs> Any last words? I would just stare through the hole and be like, it's okay. <laughs> okay, bye. <laughs> Thank you for understanding. <laughs> as long as you're good. <sighs> All right. Y'all know what part I'm talking about. Let's go eat your monkey brains. Have fun. <laughs> I would rather do that than stick my hand into a wall hole of bugs. I'm gonna have <sighs> a snack. It looks like little insect. Pieces. All right. I didn't think about her hair. They you don't really have didn't. any. So she got like Shanita kind of hair. It's you know what? Like yeah. Buzz. She bald. This is looking like very metropolisy. Okay. You know what I'm talking about? It reminds me of, I think her name was Kita. Is that from Atlantis, the cartoon, Disney cartoon? Sure. I don't remember. It's been 5,000 years. Milo and not Otis. I love that movie. <sighs> Elaine's biggest fear is spiders and heights. Girl, right there with you. Heights, I'm okay as long as I don't fall. Spiders, no. What if she no. went, okay, so Elaine, here's your nightmare. You're stuck in an airplane full of spiders and you either get to stay there or you have to jump out of the plane. I mean, does she have a parachute? Yes, there's a okay. parachute. <sighs> what if she was like it's made of spider webs? What if she was? <laughs> what if she was trapped <laughs> in a giant spider web over a cavernous, like canyon? Whatever. Okay. I don't think we're. I don't think we're like giving her any reason to stick around for this. Anymore. Oh, my hands are like freezing, and my body is a flame. We should have got you a nice candle to like warm your fingers over. And then like ice cube, like an ice pack from a pit's like. <laughs> sure, we'll get you those like pit bras. <sighs> the... <laughs> I don't need a pit bra, thank you. Elaine's like, okay. yep, that part of Temple of Doom is ick. Oh, okay, I have to Likes enlarge. the part of Harrison with no shirt on, obviously. Every part, thank you. <laughs> what was the kid's name, Short Round? Is yes. that what it was? He was from Goonies, right? Yeah. Yeah, he's cute. Cutie patootie. And the creepy guy's like, oh. nah, nah, la, la, or whatever, and you know, takes their hearts out. Whatever oh, yeah, says. yeah. I, everyone like said the Temple of Doom was like the, not their favorite. I think, it, and it's definitely my favorite. And he says, "Wasn't Milo on the oblongs?" I don't even. What is? What my, is oblongs? Uh, well, I was talking. I don't know oblongs this, but I was talking about Atlantis, like Milo. I don't know, the explorer. Wrong. Okay. Adrian says, "What the <sighs> god pick in hell? Couldn't you pick a bunny or something?" Hey, right. Guys. Hey. <laughs> but I'm not scared of bunnies. I'm not scared of snakes. I'm not scared of. I'm just scared of things with like six or more legs. I mean, unless I'm like in the woods with a bear, obviously. But okay, like, got it. well, you have bear spray for that. Yeah, we're gonna start with the eyes. She's gonna have blackish, bluish skin for the most part. Seems easy. Red eyes. 
Simple. Maybe, I'll, maybe I'll give her some reddish hair. All I'm I know curious. is it's going to look way better than if I did it. Maybe. We don't know. Why do I always want to dip my brush in my coffee cup? It's like way over there. And I see it and I'm like, yeah, let's dip it into that. Someday you're going to actually do that and then you're going to have to make a painting out of coffee. Oh, I, well, I'm not going to paint with coffee because that's too much work, but I definitely dipped my brush in my drink. You could totally do it, kid, but what, why is it too much work? Because I have to like make multiple strengths of coffee. I don't want to just paint with one because I need to do like 500 layers and it's Lazy. like, I got Okay, you prepare all the coffee for me and then I'll do it. And our house will smell like burnt coffee. Although Casey Golden, hello, amazing artist, uh, <laughs> did it with coffee and like, <laughs> she like went all out making the different, uh, strengths i can't think of the actual word anyway so we got nice red eyes elaine said when she watched snakes on a plane it was like heck no well maybe i'd have to jump <laughs> yeah that looks natural she's got a nice healthy glow for dry red eye yep started painting talking less well, Kelly said it does remind him of Metropolis. He'll, I think he's having trouble connecting, but he said it reminds him of Metropolis, and he said we're doing great, and uh, love what he watched so far. Hi, Kelly. I don't think he's... I think he got disconnected. Well, we the love... The internet in Idaho, you know. Love and miss him. Uh, freak out. Anyone want to admit your fears live on the comment section of this so we can all talk about it together? No judgment. None. I'm scared of bugs and spiders. I'm scared of the truth. You should be. Are there other things that I'm scared of that I don't... I don't know. Mostly I'm just talking phobias. Work but... obligations? Yo. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I just skipped a beat there. Palpitations, palpitations. <laughs> the W word. Adrian says yes, I have to think of one. Well, you're lucky if you have to like think of one. True. Denise says the Oblongs is a show about a family that lives in a chemical town and they all have malformations. Fun! Is this a real documentary esque style, style show? Or it sounds is this like it's like a scripted. children's show. <laughs> I hope it's for it's, the kids. I hope it's about it's, malformations. I hope it's a, it's a scripted show. Whatever. We had Ren and Stimpy growing up. <sighs> Okay. That was a messed up cartoon. It was, twas, twas. I'm gonna kind of just put on some base colors here and there and around. Let's just use this goldish color, add a little extra yellow to it. She says it's an animation. Oh, I can like watch the chat without having to watch the video back on here. So that makes it go faster. Oh my God, dreams do come true when you figure stuff out. Trisha says, dentists, I have a real phobia. Oh, Unhappy interesting. Face. Is it from like something that happened as a kid or just always? Never liked the dentist. Elaine says, are you feeling better, Rocky? You sound better than last week. Yes, I'm feeling way better. I felt better the next day. I yeah, like the next actually. day, yeah, we were almost, like, I would say 100%, basically. Yeah. Kimball, did you watch Ryan Stippy growing up? Not really. I remember I really liked it, but I think it's because there were so many, like, undertones of things that ended up being, like, adult in later life. That pertains to you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I... I don't know. I didn't. I don't. Really, I even today. I don't really like zany cartoons, like wacky ones. We're like we're zany. We're zany. Like SpongeBob. Like it's like I love it, and I love like the stories and stuff that they have. But like I can only watch like two or three episodes, and I'm like, okay, I'm done. I'm done for this year. You watch two or three episodes of that? Uh, not at once. Well, just have to go see the musical. See, yeah, that's why I don't want to see the musical. But then I listen to the song. You would the, love the musical. Well, I listen to the Everyone soundtrack. Everyone would love that musical. Uh, anyway, I watch more sophisticated cartoons like Gummy Bears. Wow. And My I mean, Little Pony. Gargoyles. That's start with a G for you to like it. Hey, My Little Pony. My I don't want to give her just straight up black skin, so I'm going to take some of my mermaid. I don't know if you can see this paint palette. Probably not. It's way over here. Could you move everything into frame, Kibble? Oh, my life is in frame. Okay. We're just doing this. There you now. go. See? Now it's weird. Is it? Anyway, that color. Yes, because it's like on a hill. And we're just going to bring oh, it down here, go. adding some black. Adding a lot of black to this. I really don't paint with black, so I'm not 100% sure how this is going to turn out. Denise Let's... says, Courage the Cowardly Dog is one I love too. And then Jenna says, Trisha, I'm there with you. Until recently, I would panic when I went to the dentist. I finally found one that's really understanding, and I'm never leaving them. Never. I know. That was the one thing I don't like about moving, is that I find a really good doctor or a really good dentist. And I'm like, but I don't want to have to find another one, because they're so good. 
My doctor in Portland, Oregon was amazing. This is very green. Trisha says a dentist yelled at her when she was about four or five. She Aww. locked herself in the bathroom because she was so scared. I can go for checks up checkups, but I'm really scared. That would be traumatizing. That's not cool. Lisa says, sorry, I'm late. Yeah, well, we were all wondering, Lisa. Okay, yeah, we all just like, sat around here waiting. Next time I'll send you a note. Just kidding. Not gonna. Welcome. <laughs> just kidding, I'm not gonna. Happy <laughs> Sunday. This isn't a school room. <laughs> um, spiders and roller coasters. Adrian's not down. Yeah, I don't like roller coasters. Again, liked them as a kid. Don't like them as an adult. So I we need think... to get a nice, like, spider-themed roller coaster for Adrian to just conquer her fears all at once. Absolutely. Maybe it's like you're sitting in a big spider carcass as, like, the, the ride. No? Okay. Yeah, I don't know if you should... I don't, I don't see you being a therapist or anything like that. Okay. <laughs> You're like, let's get over these fears real we'll quick. We'll get to the root of the problem in one session. I'm going to save your money. <laughs> um, Lisa says, laugh, laugh. And then Lisa <laughs> says, hi, Jenna. And then Adrian says, side, laugh, cry face. <laughs> I'm not really scared of the... I've always had a good experience with my dentist, though. Lucky. So... Not afraid of that, even though I am changing my dental appointment. It has nothing to do with the dentist. It just has to do with the cicadas. Cicadas, cicadas. They're everywhere. Kimball was trying to tell me there was a guy named John Cicada or something or something. <laughs> Singer. Whatever. And I was like, no, it's John Cena. He's like, no, John Cicada. I was like, like, John Cena. We had a big argument, and then he had to pull up on the song. I'm like, dude, not the wrestler. <laughs> not Fred's dad. Wait, what was the song? I don't know. Whatever, I'm over it now. It, he also did, I think he did um, the song for Pocahontas at the end. Pain with all the colors of the wind. Not that one? I mean, I don't think... Here, Kim, we'll have a snack. Okay. I'm like, I don't know why I'm getting weight. Mm -hmm. I'm like, Here, Kim, we'll have a snack! Mm -hmm. Kimber says the eye doctor is terrifying for me. When they check the eye pressure and they move <laughs> the little blue light and it touches your lens. Oh my god, yeah. It doesn't really freak me out, but I was, I'm like, when's that little puff of air going to shoot out and hit my eyeball? I know. I feel like I'd rather go bungee jumping. At least I can oh, control no. it. I don't think I will ever bungee jump. And I'm okay with that. I don't have, like, I have 20-20 vision or whatever, but I went for an eye checkup just because I was like, I'm 30-something. I should go. So I went. They did the eye check. And then... The next day, I had a sty that lasted six months. And I was like, damn it. Why did I go to the eye doctor? I was like, if it ain't broke, don't fix it. That's true. But I do think you look absolutely smashing in a pair of glasses. So. Thanks. Well, I don't need them except for the blue light glasses. Kimbra says, the eye doctor got so mad at me when I flinched. He had a secretary come in and string me in the chair. What? What? I'm sorry. Where do you live? <laughs> <laughs> that would not fly with me. Although it says the secretary came in and can strung, can string me in the chair. I don't know, whatever. Um, wouldn't go into the sea either because of all the crabs and seaweed. Agree. I get creeped out going in the ocean. Yeah. There's too much. I'm just like, can you, do people not like think about all the icky things in the ocean? Like the goblin's going to get me. Lisa says, which reminds <laughs> me, I have an appointment tomorrow for an eye test. Yay. Yay. Don't get the sty, Lisa. <laughs> And then Jenna says, oh, my God, reminds me, I was planning a kitchen for a customer this week, and their kid was watching Little Mermaid in the background. I had a really hard time concentrating and not singing. <laughs> well, Jenna, you know me. I would have stopped the session. You're like, excuse me. <laughs> refunded the money and started singing with the kid. Absolutely. She's looking good so far, Kimmy. You know, I do try Let's give it a few more minutes for you to mess it up. Thank you. Just kidding. I have full faith in you. Well, I haven't used question. I'm sorry. He went up at the end there. <laughs> in you. I'm practicing my inflections. Okay. Mm. Um, I haven't done colored pencils on this paper, which I'm assuming it'll be fine. Oh, Kimber says constrained, not string. Ah. I, I like the string definition better, actually. I Either like, way, more, though. It leaves more to my imagination. I'm like, no, no, no. You're not tying me up. Mm -hmm. We don't do that well. <laughs> Denise says she's totally coming along great. Thanks, Denise. Oh, thank you. Okay, who else has fears? Come on, out with it. <laughs> Tell me all your fears. There's your laundry at. We're all talking about it. You might find a lifelong friend. You never know. <laughs> I'm scared of holes. <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> PG, keep it PG. There is a thing that I was uh, reading it, like that people are scared of like right. holes or like emptiness. Like, right, right, right. I know, but just the way you said it. Not that type of 
<laughs> it's funny because it's inappropriate and childish. You know what's inappropriate and childish? All the dust on this computer table. No. That sounds like a fun project for you tomorrow. <laughs> I'm really busy tomorrow. It's Monday, right? Oh, Jenna gave one of her updates. She says, tonight Kimball is playing doing mixed media cicadas inspired portrait using various supplies. The snack is blah, 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 blah. Y'all know what it is. <laughs> I don't want to try to pronounce it again. <laughs> Does anyone else have this problem where you keep going like on trips and you're like, oh, candles, I need to get this to commemorate the trip. Or like you go to Home Goods and you're like, I need this candle. And then you end up with 80 candles you never light. Does anyone else do this or is it just us? I light them. Like we got this in New York. We're like this smells so good. This Meyer lemon. We're totally going to use that. I don't think we we may have, like lit it once. Well, the guy was such a sweetheart. Here, smell it. Yep, smells good. We bought it in the uh, in Chelsea, right? Candles are like the go-to when you go into a shop and you feel guilty for not buying anything. You're like, well, let's get a candle. Yeah, well, let's get this thirty or forty dollar candle. I'm sure it's worth it. Trisha says it's just you. <laughs> Fine, Trisha. Hey, she don't lie. Just kidding. We know we have a problem. I'll solve it. <laughs> Missy says, for years I was addicted to Yankee Candle Store. Oh my God, yes, girl. There was a store in the Boise Mall called Wicks and Sticks. <gasps> Obsessed. I was like, can this just smell my, my room? But then you go in there for like 10 minutes and you're like, I feel like I'm going to bark. It is so sweet. Did you just do like a fairy godmother swoosh of your hand as you said obsessed? <sighs> Obsessed. I don't know. I think you did. I don't keep track of how amazing I am. Um, Denise says, yep, I do it all the time. And then Noah says, my mom had a closet full of candles. Ooh, a candle closet. Were they turquoise? I wish that was the closet I was in when I was a child. <laughs> <laughs> when were you ever in the closet? I know, Let's right? be real. Let's be real. I well, know. I guess kind of. Whatever. Well, it was kind of like a glass door closet. <laughs> I was in there, but everybody could see me. <laughs> and they all knew. Before I did... Ooh, Jane is revealing a secret. She says, I accidentally stepped on a giant green, <laughs> bright green cicada as a young kiddo, and I was so devastated. I have been ultra kind to them ever since. Oh, no, they can go. I don't know what happened to me, but I have a really hard time, like, hurting insects and spiders. I have to catch them all and put them out now. Yeah. I don't know when this happened, but I just feel like I don't have the right to, like, hurt them. Yeah. And the, the little spider that like made a home on our little railing out front, his name's Ted. Mm. Just so you know, Kimball. Ted. Ted and I don't really get along. Uh, you know, they're whatever. What I don't like also are mosquito eaters. I don't care if they're harmless. They come at you. For whatever reason, they, <laughs> come, they come at me all the time. And I don't know why. It's so disturbing. Well, it's that same like principle of like, they know that you don't want them the most. It's like when we go out in public and like all the crazy people come up to you. I know. Let me rub your belly for luck. Excuse me, sir. Inappropriate. You're going to need to back away, sir. <laughs> like, oh my God, we went shopping today and I feel like Kimball just attracts everybody. Oh my God. We go shopping and we're walking out. <laughs> we just finished checking out. We're walking out the door. We're just getting ready to walk out. A woman just stops dead in the center. And she's like, so I, I added some um, fertilizer to my yard. You think the cicadas will be okay, right? Like we had been having a conversation for 20 minutes. Kimball and I just I'm like, like ma'am, do you, do I look like I work in the yard? Now, mind you, I'm there. I'm totally there for those like moments. I just like fully stopped and pretended I knew who she was. Like we had been having a conversation. We talked for maybe like a minute and a half. We talked about her children, not about our age, all this yeah, stuff. Yeah, they've moved out, moved on. I'm so fascinated by those interactions. I'm not. I could do without. And I mean, I don't mind if some because I'm like, oh, hey, I have a question. Sure. But like just coming up and what? Why? I'm, yeah, I want to do that when I'm older. I want to definitely do that to like younger people. Just go up, start having conversations just to see how they react. I mean, I guess maybe someday. You got to mess with the youths, Kimball. That's what keeps them young. <laughs> <clears throat> Jane says, as long as they don't rush me, I'm kind to bugs. Um, but if they rush up, I'm swinging. I know. I was like telling Rocky, <laughs> I picture myself if I knew like any type of karate, I'd be like kicking them like roundhousing. I, don't, I just imagine myself doing these amazing things that I would just throw my back out in reality. Trisha says she's like me. She likes to try to evict the insects from the house. The cat just eats them. <laughs> <laughs> when we had a cat, it didn't do anything. She was like, yeah, there's bugs here. Oh my gosh. Adrian says she's allergic to mosquitoes. Could you imagine? That would be so Ew. bummer. She says she turns black and blue. Oh my Lord. Well, moment of silence for that. 
Missy says around the neighborhood, I see people walking with yellow black tennis rackets. I finally Google it's mosquito racket zapper. Oh my if, God, Kimball that's had, so funny. if Kimball was outside in like a swarm of bugs, he would be a pro player of like hitting. He would be swinging so fast. You wouldn't even see him swinging. Either that or I'd pass out. We're not sure yet. You'd Let's hear see. a high shrill and you'd wonder where it's coming from. It would be Kimball. <laughs> yes. I need to. Um. Oh God, you're just like in my face, you ugly creature. I just wanted to check their legs. They're a little They're more reddish. Beautiful, Kimball. The universe up. created them. Okay. Well, it can go find a different planet to populate. What did I just think about? Oh, it's legs. I'm like, I'm doing something. Well, the cicada woman looks nice. I'd be friends with her. Do you think she shops at um, Home Goods? Sure. Is that the only <laughs> store I can think of? <laughs> well, I figured that's where you were going to go with it. Um, you know, I couldn't tell you honestly where she shops. <laughs> Kimber says when those giant palmetto roaches visit the studio, I don't care how many of their legs break because I sweep it in the dustpan. <laughs> oh, God. I saw somebody built like it looks like a transformer demon made out of cicada shells. Wow. It looks oh, so yes. Creepy. I saw that. It was nasty. Yeah. I'm like, really? No, that's not what they're for. Eater, <laughs> eater. Oh. People are so creative. Mm. <laughs> Jenna says, Rocky, can you please buy the Kimball, the racket zapper and film Kimball with it? <laughs> Absolutely. I have been, Kim I have been filming Kimball randomly at moments when he doesn't realize I'm filming and now he's like paranoid and thinks. I'm always like, where's your camera? Where's your phone? Where's your phone? Where's your phone? Like seriously, where's your phone? Or if I'm like Kimball, he's like, I'm not coming in there. You're filming. I'm all, no, we can talk from here. However, I have so much priceless footage of Kimball that we'll just, if I started a TikTok account, I'd have a year's worth of content right off the gate. I'm like, yes, why am I so weird? You're not weird, you're awesome. I know, but like weird too. Kimball and I can't figure out why, like we'll record ourselves randomly sometimes or if we're vlogging or whatever. And like, we don't laugh in the moment, but then we'll watch it back later and just be dying. And I'm like, why isn't it that funny in the moment? Why is it funnier when it's captured on film? I don't know. Maybe it's because we're a little scared that it could be shared with other people. <laughs> and that, that, that just makes it so much more exciting. What is everyone else snacking on tonight or eating besides air? Anybody want to snack on a cicada? Elaine says, I'm imagining Kimball at next year's Wimbledon Tennis Championships. <laughs> <laughs> as long as there's bugs around, he wouldn't even need to know mm. he's playing. I Mm -mm, no, I'm so just not a bug. Or if you made, if you like painted the tennis ball to be a giant bug, I think you would nail it. Although you would probably just hit it right out of the stadium. <sighs> yeah, I would. Yeah, I would have a little too much adrenaline going. Maybe I'm baseball gonna, is more your sport then. Let's do like a dark purpley shade. Kim, more you ever in T-ball? Yes. And I remember standing in the. Would you recommend it to a friend? No. In the outfit. Well, I didn't want to play. It was like my two brothers wanted to play, so I had to go too because they all played at the same time. My parents had so many kids that we all had to go, whatever. So I was kind of like shoved into doing it. I hated it. Um, but I remember being in the outfield picking daisies. That's <laughs> and my dad was like, Yeah, you should watch the game. And like, you know, so when you know when the ball's coming at you. I'm like, I don't care. <laughs> they're like you're on oh, they didn't know back then it's beyond us they're like and you're gonna play shortstop i'm like and where is that <laughs> like what am i doing I, I just picture your dad talking to you for five minutes about the rules and then you're like uh -huh. like and this uh -huh. applies to me how so when we can go, can we all go home now or and i'm like how much longer do we have to be here Ooh, missy is having crack cracker barrel delivery cornbread Ooh. meatloaf turnip green carrots girl you fancy yum i actually really like cracker barrel I do too. I've only, been be there once. I've only been there once. Their food is so affordable. I remember I dropped you off in Kansas City once and I was like all depressed. and like, I'm going to go eat my feelings. And I went to Cracker Barrel. I was like, I feel a lot better. I remember when we moved to Philadelphia and we stopped at Cracker Barrel in the middle of the country somewhere. Mm. That was the first one I'd ever been to. I'm like, wait, is this like a restaurant or a store? Yes, I remember that. It was, yep. Mm -hmm. yep, 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 yep. No, that is right. By Des Moines, Iowa. Yeah, it was somewhere in there. Anyway, it was just halfway across. That's all I kind of remember. Michelle is having these new frozen dark chocolate covered cherries and raspberries. So good. They that sound, sound good. I don't know. That sounds delish. Just don't be eating anything with figs because then Kimball's going to go off on his like wasps crawl into them <laughs> and die. Well, Speech. 
See, it's one of those like the more you know, the more I hate bugs. Yeah, but without the bugs, yes. nature would just fall apart. The ecosystem needs them. But do I? Yes, technically. <laughs> somehow. I just I don't know. What if I told you in 10 years you're going to be running like a an insect preserve? I'll and that you are you so fully hard. in I, It's not my doing. I'm not the one that did it, Kimball. I'm saying that you did it. Um, I wouldn't. And what would you say if I told you that? Like, what would you start doing right now in your life? Learning how to do something indoors to make money. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> well, this is a good starting point. I'm like, no, I'm, I'm not gonna. Mm -mm. We're not doing bugs. Michelle says Target and Costco. I love them both. What are we talking about? Maybe... That's what she's eating right now. I'm not sure. I do love a delicious Target. And Costco. <laughs> Sprinkled on top of my Costco. Um, Let's see. For the wings, maybe I'll try a little white. I'm not sure how it's going to play with this paper. Oh, I think she's saying that she got her uh, dark chocolate covered cherries ah. and raspberries at Target. And, or she, you can get them at Target and Costco. Well. I know what we're doing after this. Having a salad? Playing Skyra. <laughs> That's a pretty color. Is that ju that's just the white on that paper? Yeah, that's cool. Um, it'll sink in though and kind of disappear. Let that sink in. No, that's kind of what I want because I want it to look like it's see through, but it wets the paper too, so the paper gets darker. Oh, it's a double edged sword. I'm sorry. Who did you sound like just then? Um, I sound like remember the. Charlie, yes. the magic rainbow or whatever. Like, come on, Charlie, it's the magic bridge. Yep. I yep. don't even know what they say, but I remember that. The unicorn. Come on, Charlie. It's always a little hit and miss with this because I don't know if it's how much it's going to darken up. What's the first internet meme you guys remember back in the day? Like, what is the first thing that caught your eye? And it can't be hamster dance. It has to oh be something God. other than hamster dance. I don't even know if I'd be able I'd, I'm all cat videos. Like what, though? No idea. I didn't even start watching YouTube until like a couple years ago. I'm trying to think about the first thing. It, I remember this one that was like talking. It was an Australian accent. It was someone talking about oh. the world. WTF, uh, mate. Do you remember this? I thought it was going to be the guy and the dogs. WTF, mate. Do you remember this? And it's talking about like the destruction of the world. No. That's what I remember. The first thing I remember watching. Jenna says she's cutting out unicorn fabric right now. See, meant to be. Nice. Meant to be, Jenna. Nice. All right. Well, wow, that actually really made that necklace look metallic when you did that. Yeah, but they're going to fade in. Okay. That's well, okay. Though. It sucks. You suck. Just kidding. I love it. You're the best, Kimball. I know. You guys help me. Here, have a snack. I'm busy drawing. Are you too busy drawing to have a snack? Uh -uh, I bad. want this one that feels like a weird gelatin with like bug pellets. Okay. Um, Kimber said she has a she had a few bites of demac when she first logged on. I don't know what demac is. Can you explain? And then Jenna says the first thing I remember really watching online was Homestar Runner. I've heard of it. I just don't remember what it is. Yep, no idea. This paper doesn't really buckle, which is surprising because it's just squishy paper. I don't even know what it is. It feels like construction paper. It's Indiana Jones parchment. Is that the official title? Mm -hmm. Can I like go into Blix and be like, "Hey, do you have some Indiana Jones parchment?" No, be like, "Do you have any IJP?" No. Oh. Make so. everything an acronym. There's not enough of them, especially in corporate world. Here reminds me of Buffy. Moo. Nice acronym, Mom. <laughs> okay. Let's not get down to business because I'm an adult and we don't just burst out into Mulan songs. Wait, we move that more in the center of frame. Do it for the people, Kimball. This? Yeah. Like, center that way. I mean, like, or whatever, that way. You want this in the center of the frame? Yeah, just move it towards me a little bit. And then down. There you go. Great. I love that. No, I'm really glad love I could do that. that do you. it for me. Now it's, like, totally off-center to me, though. Uh, well, don't do that, then. You can move back where I already pulled out color pencils, because I am in a res and a responsible... I am a responsible adult that knows a little bit of English. Color pencils. Okay. Speak to me, darling. You're creepy. Mm. Her name is Genevieve. Is it? You want to tell it to our friend down the street named Genevieve? 
We have a friend down the street named Genevieve. Jenny. Her name is Genevieve? <laughs> yes. Shut up. Well, the more you know. I didn't know that. Yeah, I'm totally like, Genevieve, when I see her name. Yeah, she just goes by uh, Jenny just because nobody pronounces her name right. Okay. I call her Vive. Mm. Kimber's having chocolate bar with pistachios. Oh, that sounds good, too. But you know what I really want? I want the pistachio um, biscotti. That I make? Yeah. Yeah, me too. Can, can you do that? Yeah, go Thanks. get stuff. I'll make some tonight. No, no, you get it. I already went shopping. Hmm. I'm busy. Okay. Kimball, what are you doing this week? Well, it's like a really busy one for me. I have a couple of naps <laughs> planned. Um, <laughs> Lies! I don't know. What do I do every week? You just... I do a lot of our... Being adorable. I don't know what you tell me. I'm going to need to film a couple things because we are... Uh, we're going to be out and about. I don't know if we're going to... I need to do some precautionary film like videos just in case oh, we're yes, out of town traveling. right so whoa excuse me yeah keep it to yourself grosso you're gonna need to do eight videos kimball eight of them actually eight. well i don't want to i don't want to say too much okay um so colored pencils kind of work weird on this it works but it's well it looks like you have to really work it well i'm, I'm not pushing very hard because i don't i don't trust myself just yet I scare myself. <laughs> what do you call your method of art? Hope for the best. Got it. Just make that an acronym. <laughs> uh, as we all start, like, sounding it out in our heads. HFTB. Yeah, I'm not good with that. I can do, like, the work talk. That doesn't align with me. Let's put a pin in that. <laughs> Let's trek back. Let's talk uh, offline. Oh, my God. I can't. Work talk, work talk. Wait, I was gonna give her like a creepy dark pupil in her middle of her eye. You can still do the light though. Great, everyone's gonna have lovely before work week nightmares. It'll be great. She's looking into your soul and she knows your secrets. She knows your credit score, I can tell. <laughs> She's like, <laughs> you know what this reminds me of? Got it reminds me of like, We've been trying to reach you about your car's <laughs> extended warranty. Stupid. <laughs> oh, like, is... that's the person who calls and like, I'm calling from dealership services. Like, that's what she looks like. Oh, for my sure. God. I don't care if she's a cicada woman or not. Like, that's the person who calls every time. Well, I'm not giving her any information. Terrifying woman. Kimber says, if you like pistachio, you would love to mock. You can find it at World Market. I know Ooh. another reason we need to go, Kimball. I know. I wish they would build one close to us. It's like 45 minutes away. It is ridiculous. I don't know how we ever ended up in this position. Although, where we're an hour away from World Market. When we visit home, there's one just like two miles from my parents' house. Is it? Oh, yes. Right. It's by the mall. I love there. World Market. I do too. I feel like I'm really traveling, having experience. Yeah. Plus, they have my Toronto serve, which I love. But I'm not. I'm just in suburbia. <laughs> they have a lot of really good stuff there. They have, a, like, a lot of really interesting things, like, to try there, if you like foreign food. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Now, that is, tell me more. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> I'm going to open up this random journal and find something to share. Okay. Which journal? I don't know. It's like. Oh, there's only, like, two or three pages in there. I hate this one, then. I'm sorry, my love. They're all cute, though. Mm. Sparkly. Obviously. Oh, look, another candle we haven't used. Which one is that? It is Driftwood Sands. What? Oh, well, that was for our last house. That was the scent of the house, and we only Ooh, it really is the scent of that house. Wow. Yeah. That, like, took me right back when I smelled that. Yeah, we burned... Because we bought, like, three or four of them, and we burned it all the time. Ooh, don't get rid of that. I want to have that forever. I'd be like, Philadelphia! <laughs> the Philly home. That was a good choice, Kimmy. I know. Thanks, Target. You really know what we're looking for. Target understands me. Kimball. Yes, my love. Guess what? Snack time? I have to go to work tomorrow. Like, away from the house. Uh -huh. And this affects me how? You're going to be alone. And this affects me how? <laughs> you could have some peace and quiet. I'm like, are you actually going to get up in the morning? Yes. Uh, 
That's the only difference. I'm doing it. No, stop me. Alarm is set. For what time? Like 8.30. Oh, my God. No, I think I'd like 8. I have to be there by 9. Well, calm down. I know. It's just a really <laughs> early one for everybody. <laughs> Jesus. Woo. Well, I'm going to need a darker color. That's basically that color. I need a good golden brown, maybe with a hint of red. Hmm, what are you? Tuscan red. Flip to the back and check on the pages. What are you going to look like when I lay you down? Oh, my God. That sounded inappropriate. But yeah. You know what? It's because you're perverted. Okay. You're perv. Can I mix it with that color? Yeah, that'll probably work. Why not? Who's got time to figure it out? That's right. Not this guy. I've got nothing to do after this. You have to guess how many minutes it's been without looking. 38. Close. 46. Okay. Don't okay. rush it. Don't be suspicious. Dennis says she has to go back to the office the first week of June. They're putting us on a rotation for one week in the office and two weeks at home. Interesting. I wonder how many come. I mean, like this past year was such like a trial and error kind of thing. I wonder how many companies are going to let people work from home a little more. I hope a lot of them do, if it makes sense for their workforce. Right. And if it makes I think people... we, have a, we have a 50% thing going forward, so we get to work halfway, like half and half. And, like, I mean, if it makes people happier and more productive, I say good on them. Honey, you got bug feet on your necklace. Nobody knows that. It just looks like jewelry. What did I call her again? I can't remember her name now. I don't know. Phyllis? No, I can't remember what it was. No, but she calls about car warranties, apparently. Yes, she's the woman that calls about your car's extended warranty. I don't even have a car. Why did they call me? So, Kim, what else yes. do you want to talk about tonight as you're doing Bug Girl? I know you love talking while you are, because it's not distracting. <laughs> Um, oh, we just finished, uh, Lovely Writer. Yes. That was a good one. Lovely Writer, the series, if you're into the BLs. I mean, who isn't? Elaine says she's now working permanently from home. Oh, that's fantastic. I'm happy. That makes me happy. I don't know why. I just, Yay! I just, you know, like you can stay at home, save yourself the commute. You don't have to get up and like shower right before work. Like. Can really take your time. Ease into the day, darling. I have thoroughly enjoyed this year. Like as far as like personal life. Uh, I know. I'm like, aside stuff. from the awful things that happened outside of our home. Right, right. We were very fortunate. Kimbra says, Oh, Genevieve, thank you, Kimbra. Um, she mm -hmm. says, I think the paper was a great choice for Genevieve. The scamming cicada. <laughs> Perfect. We're on to you. Jenny. Genevieve the sand scanning cicada. I messed it up. I don't know why I thought you were gonna be like bouncing here and there. I was trying to do like an 80s like it sounded like TV the gummy bear show. Song. I was like, you know, like perfect strangers. <laughs> do, 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 do. Standing tall. Excited to be scamming. Call oh <laughs> for your cars extended warranty. Yes. All right. Let's put a little highlight on her. Jewelry. Give me this. I'm trying to use up my Sharpies before I use up my Jane Davenport ones, but they are the same tip. I'm like 99.9% .9 sure it's the same tip. Nice little tip like that. Be careful with paint pans because you know how they can ooze and bleed and be gross. Oh, see, I should have done colored pencil because this is so vibrant. You're just going to need to put it everywhere. Probably. Everybody calm down. The white pen is at work. Everyone just feels like the end is near whenever you pull that thing out, Kimball. Everyone gets a dash of depression whenever you whip out the white paint pen pen. White paint pen pen pen. Now, I'm pretty sure their little wing vein things are black. Just poke my face in and open my phone up. Yeah, they're, oh, they're orange. They're orange and black. Oh, they're so gross. You should do them whatever is going to be the prettiest. Here, have a snack. No, I'm really busy right Here, now. Here, Kim, and look how it matches the journal. See how I chose that wisely? You're like so. I bad. know. I know. I don't know. I'm how really I... the best. 
You are. How do I function without you? You know what I did today? I hung that one picture that's been sitting in the hallway for a month. How do I live without you? I already know. Mmm. Mmm. <laughs> I think someone else went live because we went from 20 people to 11. <laughs> no, Jane may have gone live. <laughs> Maybe. That's okay. I'll allow it if it's Jane. Mmm. As I just say that now, everyone else is like, bye. <laughs> That's all right. <laughs> she says, no, I'm watching you. <laughs> Jane oh, does. Oh, Jane. Oh, <laughs> hey, girl. Hey. Thanks for watching, y'all. Yeah. If we don't say this every time, I'll say it now. We really appreciate everyone tuning in and watching Kimball. We do. And chatting with us. We always look forward to Sunday nights because we get to hang out with our friends. Our our friends. <laughs> my friends. Oh my god, that anime. When they were doing the outtakes. No, I don't know. Well, look, I did it on that side. I got it on this side. Hmm. Kim, what's your next like big art adventure gonna be? I don't know. Jane, what's your next um, art supplies you're releasing? <laughs> <laughs> Are you going to base it around what Jane releases? I don't know. I have to try everything she makes. There you go. I think you should do more stuff on wood because these are really pretty. Well, go buy me some wood. Well, I have to go to Home Depot. Oh, my God. Project. Like, look how cool she is. <sighs> yeah, I liked her. I think I did a video. I actually think I posted that on the Jane Dub for If you think Kimball should do more stuff on wood, let us know. Hi, let me know. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> wow. You're really selling it there, right? <laughs> that was her voice. It wasn't me. Oh, okay. That's really blue. Not the green one. Defining edges. Because why wouldn't I? <laughs> Jane says she just posted in the group. I think going live with art is courageous and needs to be celebrated. Oh, thanks, Jane. We love you. Mm. And then Blatt S says, I've been binge watching your older videos and loving the AC fish inspired mermaid. Oh, Animal Crossing, yes. Oh my god, I got some hate with those. Not really hate, but some upset people because they thought it was like how to catch that fish in Animal Crossing. Are you but, serious? That's so funny. But then they were like, but then I stayed and watched you create anyway. <laughs> it's like, oh, oh well, that's nice. So I was a little scared when I was reading those comments and I was like, oh, okay. It ended well. Jane said she texted Angus to get a package ready for you. Oh. I know what we're creating. Yay. Um, Trisha says, do more stuff on Wood Campbell. Okay. Um, and then Kimber says, I agree, Jane, it is courageous. Kimball and I have talked a lot about, because like, whenever he goes live, he's like, I feel like I rush and I don't do like the type of work I really want, but he has so much fun talking with everyone. Right. But it's like, he, as an artist, he gets really distracted. So he like, I don't know. I can see why he would be like frustrated by that, but it has definitely not stopped us from doing it. And we were talking about how he just needs to like go slower and take his time and like really do the piece he wants to do, even if we're going live. What else, Kimball? Um, you want to add to that? No, but I want to add some neon pops of Obviously. pink because that's just what I do. But we appreciate everyone's support. It actually goes a really long way and is very motivating. Um, so we very much appreciate all of you. And you're like the loot from that show, Moulin Rouge. You only speak the truth. Wow. <laughs> <sighs> what else? I feel like I need to shade in her mouth a little bit. Casey Maybe. says, I agree. It's great watching someone create live. And then Jane says, yes, totally get that rushed feeling when live. It's like, I'm super nervous beforehand. I'm like, I always freak out. I don't know why. And then once I get started, it definitely gets a lot better. And I'm like, yes, oh, I want to keep going. But then I was like, I get to the point, I'm like, am I boring now? <laughs> like, how... Well, I think the, the thing is, it's like, it's okay to be boring sometimes. Like if you need to like focus on something, it's not, the whole thing doesn't need to be like entertaining start to finish. It's like, we're here for a process. Well, it's also like, I don't, I enjoy creating the same thing over and over again, like the same technique and stuff. Cause it's just what I enjoy doing, but I'm like, do people get bored of seeing it? Well, they can so I, find something else. So I feel like there's that pressure to come up with something new. Right. You have to be new and innovative, Kimball. And that's like a lot of work. And if you know me, that's not my style. <laughs> I'm a, a lot of work. What? Kimber says, I'm too afraid to go to try live. Girl, the first time I went, it was an accident. I thought it was like private. Like I could just test it out and see how it went. 
And then people started commenting me and I freaked out. <laughs> <laughs> I totally forgot about that. Kimball did have like an anxiety attack. Pretty like much. I was just playing with mermaid markers just to see how it went. And then, cause I didn't know how to like upload stuff and like how it all worked. Yeah, it just, apparently I did it right, and it just started playing. Or remember when we, like, tried, we were just experimenting with all the equipment, and we accidentally oh, no, was, went live? We were trying that new program to do multiple right, cam cameras right. or something. Yeah, oh, my God. Trisha says, I'm always amazed how Kimball just keeps working through all the chat and laughs. You guys <laughs> don't even know. I am so distracting. I know, Mike. <laughs> have you, I mean, Rocky's my husband. Right. <laughs> I've been training for this for years. The fact that anything turns out. <laughs> um, Jenna says, it makes me so happy to see Kimball live. I know how much it took to get comfortable getting to this point. Heart, sparkles. Aww. I love hearts and sparkles. Jenny says, she's spectacular, Kimball. Love those pops of red. Oh, I thank you. Is there something I'm missing? I didn't go as dark as I wanted to with her skin, but I like the way it turned out. So I'm like, mm, we're going to hold off. Um, maybe add some. Were you going to use silver or something? Yes, thank you. Yes, I remember you talking about it. See, this is why this is why we talk beforehand. Kimball's always like he he goes through this thing where he like talks about all the things he's gonna do, and then he always like forgets to do all of them, right, or like get, just skips it. Because I just get so distracted, and I'm like, wait, that is nothing like what I planned on doing. Um, yes, where's my? Excuse me, watercolors need my sparkly pens. <laughs> I wish that as you were doing that, it made some kind of like squeaky sound. Why? Or it sounded like wasps. I gotta see how this looks on this paper. You know what? I should have pulled open like a, a cicada mm. sound and had it playing in the background the whole time. Oh yeah, that no, that would be great. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> like we also Sassy. have it. Like we have it in the backyard. Oh, that's gorgeous. Okay. Okay. You're gonna get some now. Sparkles, sparkles, Charlie. Oh my god, it's so cute. I mean, it definitely absorbs more on this paper, but it's like a translucent ink with sparkly bits. Ah. Add a little in her necklace. She's worth it. I like the small things you add, even if like other people would notice. You're like, I know they're there. All right, now I am scared to do this over. I want to do it over her whole like white area of the earrings, but I'm also scared. No, nope, we're doing it. Commit, Campbell, commit. Sparkles, Charlie. Sparkles, Guinevere. <laughs> Genevieve, whatever. Ooh, that just like sucks the uh, ink right off the tip. Adrian <laughs> says, I love that journal, Kimball. Except she screamed it. She's like, I love that journal, Kimball. Oh my God. <laughs> Thank you. That's how she said it. I'm pretty sure. <laughs> pretty sure. I, I'm pretty sure I heard it accurately. Missy says, Jane, I love when you're live too. The good thing about live is it's not edited, so it's nice to also learn. I agree. Jane's fan fabulous live. Yes. If you guys don't already watch Jane live, you should watch Jane live. Or just I, Jane in general. I watch Jane live. I have multiple workshops, too. I learned quite a few things. I would say the biggest thing I learned, because I was so scared of mixing colors. And I was so scared of having a quote-unquote messy finished piece. And watching Jane's workshops, I learned so much about mixing colors and, like... um adding purple tones to shading or blue tones or whatever. I would always, when it came to coloring like skin, I would always do like light peach, dark peach. Like I never did like light peach and like mauve browns and like dark purples. It looks so much better. And it took me a while to figure it out, but I got there and I like love it. I want to see if this makes this pop more. Kim Rizal, can you imagine meeting her in real life? Jennifer? Oh, her? Yeah. <laughs> well, Jane, um, yeah. I you can imagine. meet her whenever she calls. You just have to answer the phone and just listen to her talk about your car's extended warranty. Nope. I'm going to hang up on her. Just going Jenna over. says, don't forget to like and subscribe too. Oh my God, please do. And then Carrie says, hi, Jane. And then Jane says, hi, Carrie. And everyone's like, what? Yeah, and also, why do I have so many people unsubscribe from me? That was It was really weird. I feel like a lot of people subscribe to me, like fake followers and then like they unsubscribed and it happened with my Instagram. Okay. True story. I kid you not. So I get on my Instagram one day and it's like 5,000 people have followed you. And I was like, cool. Follow back. <laughs> so I just followed all of them back. I don't think it was really 5,000, but one day I looked at my Instagram and it was over 6,000 people that I follow and I do not follow that many people. So every day for the past like month, I've been like going through deleting hundreds of people. I'm just like, who are you? You made a real mistake, Kimball. I know. Un unlike Genevieve, she wouldn't do that. Mm -mm. Genevieve knows when they're real followers. 
Yeah, it's because she's in a cult. Okay, perfect. Carrie says, that pink is killer. I love that. All right. Maybe I'll use it to outline her um, earrings. Because Every looking... time Carrie comments, I'm going to have to go like this. <laughs> See how many times she comments now? I put, um... I moved her Frida over there and My Little Pony. Oh, no, wait. Where did she she says, go? let's see your socks, boys. Oh, they're in the other room. Here, I'll grab them. One moment. I was so excited. I was like, wait, I have socks from Korea. It's like you know me so well. <laughs> hmm, Rocky, I don't know what else to do. I'm freaking did, out, man. I did pirouette over the bed to get these. Well, how else are you supposed to get them? I haven't worn them yet. Oh, it says K-Bell. Mm -hmm. K-Bell. These are mine. And then these are mine. They're avocados. To go here, I'll call to a mask. Wait, I don't even know what they say. Pass mm. the avocados. Oh, I'll pass the ass. Cute. Thanks, Thank you. <laughs> You're welcome. Oh, my God. Um. Okay, let's see what else is happening. That's like the best thing. And then she thing. says, Mwah. It's like the best day daycare. Wow. Decor that we've gotten from Michaels. <laughs> Kimber says she's the one that messed with your Instagram. <laughs> God, Genevieve. Yeah. You're ruining my life. She's like, these 5,000 people want to be your friends. And then I thought I was like so popular. I was like, oh my God, I want to be their friends too. And now I'm like deleting them all. Denise says, yes, Jane's books are awesome. I have them all. Oh my God, me too. They're sitting right next to me. I'm all in her journals and her other journals and all of our stuff. <laughs> I'm such a Jane junkie. Well, we wouldn't be doing this live if it wasn't for Jane, so. That's true. I wouldn't even be doing this if it wasn't for Jenna and Jane. Yep. So Jenny. thanks to you both. Genevieve. Jane. <laughs> Jenna. Jenna. <laughs> wow, we just, that was too much. Yep. Well, it has been an hour and two minutes. So oh. we're getting to the delirious stage. Yes, I told Rocky I wanted to try and keep my, my lives to about an hour. But should I come up with a dark color for the background? Yeah. But like keep it, not messy, but like sketchy looking. Where like, my... Are you thinking like a deep color of some kind? A really a deep philosophical color. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Okay, Sasserama. <laughs> well, I was thinking of the ink. Would you prefer a different color? Are you asking me? Yes, my opinion? I, that's too close to a skin tone and hair. I would go away from that. What color would you go? I would do like a really deep like teal or um, purple or something. Well, there's deep purple right there. She's green. I could go. Wait, much. why don't we? Oh, Carrie okay. Says, she looks like the Christmas demon. Wait, wait, wait. Demon. Carrie says purple. <laughs> it's, it's not purple. It's a lavender. I'm pretty sure that's how she said it. So if I go purple, because she has like, that might be pretty, because then she has like these bright pops of pink, which I could it add. It will be pretty, Kimball. It, it will, will be. be pretty. She's getting there. It will be. She's modest. Wow. <laughs> That's an inside joke from Ikea and Rocky's old boss. Well, you don't get to know it. Okay. Well, That's well. just for us. Okay. Oh, such a good one, too. Oh. <laughs> like, <laughs> <laughs> I felt so. Okay. Listen, pencils, you're through. Finish with you. Get out my face. Put Kimbra you. says, grab the teal. You know Noah's coming for you. I feel like there's going to be a knock on the door someday. And he's going to be like, get the teal. <laughs> Don't make a big teal about it. Wow. <laughs> nah, I'm funny. What color is it? Purple. Pip. Should I do purple or teal? Now I want to do teal. Do teal. You can really I don't have like a teal teal though. Like I have this. Kimball, you know what you can do? You can mix colors. Oh my God, it's so hard. Okay, let's take... This is what's happening now. Do it on screen. Everyone needs to see. Is it on screen? There you go. Now I'm just it's gonna on screen. I want to try and mix it with that. Okay. Make sure to make enough of it. You have a big background there. It sucks up a lot of the water. I need to add some yellow. More of that. Touch up that. Make it blue. Okay, add some more water. More of you. The magic is unfolding. Right behind your eyes. Okay, let's test it. That is one. like the exact same color as the um, paint tell you faint on your mat. Yeah, pretty close. It's a pretty dang nice color. Color, 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 color. Uh -oh. Is that sparkly? You're sparkly. No. Oh, it looks sparkly on here. Maybe it's because, you know, I'm just wet. wet. Water spark. Well, okay. Wow. It, right? Okay. Definitely don't wipe that. <laughs> you could just it's wipe, invisible you could just wipe ink. Genevieve out of existence if you Cheer. wanted to. Yes. Yeah, I don't know what's on this paper, but it does take a hot second for the paints to absorb. I can't see because the light's reflecting it weird. Oh, I'm so sorry that happened to you, baby. Uh, thank you for I'm understanding. So sorry, That's my life story, and I'm sticking to <clears> it. <throat> I'm just add some pure color. 
Should have just gone with that pure color. That's pretty. Just do a mix. I am. Mix it up. Purple. No. It's it's Pride Month in June. <laughs> and your point is? I don't know. Celebrate. Celebrate, Celebrate Idaho. It's a wonderful. I don't, you don't even words. know the lyrics, Kimball. It's Celebrate Idaho. It's a century old. Take around and enjoy what you see. Yeah, I'm sorry. I'm not a choir nerd. As I was in choir for... Although when that song was written, I wasn't in choir. I feel like we all had to learn it though, didn't we? Yes, I remember we had to go down to like the whatever Julia Davis Park and sing it in front of some like bandstand thing. That sounds pretty accurate. Um, didn't they film something like kids singing it from schools or something? I don't know. No what? one cares. Childhood. What Wait, there's that? comments. Campbell, be quiet. Shh. Karen says, greetings from wet and cold, very late Northern Ireland. <gasps> Hi, Karen. Oh, my God. I'm half Irish, so I totally feel you. Oh, cool. Can you give us your best Irish no, accent? No, my God, no. No, just go ahead real quick. Just, I... I know you know how to do it. You've done it. Just give us a little bit. Mm-mm. No. Just say, like, Scottish pie or whatever. That's uh, not That's... <laughs> <laughs> okay. I suddenly feel much better about Sorry, myself. Sorry, <laughs> Karen. All right. And then Amy says, wait, wait, that journal. I missed this journal. Deets, please. Um, well, this is actually Indiana Jones journal. Like he actually exists and he gave Kimball this journal. So that's the story about that one. That is true. No, I just, I bought From it off Amazon. Amazon.com. Yeah. I just bought it off Amazon. I just and typed in like old leather journal and it popped up. Kimbra says, fabulous contrast with the red. Oh, right. Trisha says, hi, Karen. And then Karen says, top of the morning to you both. Top, top of the, the morning. Go ahead. Top of the morning to you. See, Kimball knows how to do it. Um, Kimber says, hi, Karen. And then Jane says, that teal is genius. It's genius. Love y'all. Gotta go stamp time sign to finish. Bye. Kelly, bye. She's designing a stamp. Okay. Wait, who Bye, Jane. We love you. Bye. Okay, love you. Bye. Um, I love my love because I know. Well. Is that song called? Wait, what's the song called? Green Sleeves. How does that go? Green Broom. No, green sleeves. I don't know. I think it's the song I was just singing. Is it? I don't know. I don't think. Who am I? I'm attempting to make them look a little see-through. I see what you're going for there, Kimball, and I raise you an oh. Just adding a touch of till glamour. Am I right, girls? Am I right? I'm right. Okay. Now I kind of want to add some more of that pink. Missy says turquoise and red look good together. Agreed. Agreed, agreed. Like chocolate and peanut butter. Oh my god, we made chocolate peanut butter so bars. So are the turquoises and reds. Ate so much of them. <laughs> oh, I love it when it's our neighbor's birthday, because then we just make dessert and eat it. <laughs> I'm like, oh, whose birthday is it? Oh, it's someone's birthday. We're make some more sweets. Someone's got to be getting older in this neighborhood. Kim and I always like, we're going to eat better this month. And we're like, oh, we need to celebrate this. Oh, we need to celebrate that. Oh, we woke up, we need to celebrate. Absolutely. Every day is a gift, right? So as much as I hate cicadas, if you're late to the game, she's based on a cicada. Hate them. No, no, sorry. I hate that I am so afraid of them. Oh, wow. Kim, well, you're really growing as a And don't person, you forget it. As a terrified of bug person. Yes. We're an adults scared of teeny tiny bugs that don't hurt you. Well, you know what? They do you think do. any of that pink ever lands on her face anywhere? Like, in there any of the details? Or? I don't know. That really brought it to life. You really brought what? I mean, it kind of, it'll sink in a little bit. Let that sink in. Okay. You know how I don't like those things. Bugs? No, the, like... Here's a fact. Let that sink in. Oh. I'm like, cool. Here's a fact. Delete friend. <laughs> God. I'm just kidding. I wouldn't. I just skip over it. I think she's done. I thought I was going to do so much more to her skin, but I like the way it looks and I don't want to screw it up. Noah said, OMG, WTF, barbecue, so much tea. All right, Noah, I was thinking of you the entire time. And then Missy said, ooh, that's better with the paint pens. Do -do -do. I love the pinpoint paint pens. I want to call them P4s. Pens. The P4s. Sounds like a lot more trying to start. But isn't P4 like one of those protein power snacks or something? Comes with like four types of protein. I don't know. Whatever. Are you talking about petty fours? No. Oh, I love petty fours. No, P4s. I think it's like a snack with like peanuts and 
some kind of other pronoun. Uh-huh, uh-huh. Tell me more, Kim. I don't want to. It's tell stupid. It's stupid. I don't want Genevieve, to. call me about my car's extended warranty. Uh, she's the second one in this big book of... Je- Carrie is upset that you didn't put any purple on there. Get over it. <laughs> no purple. No, wait. I can add... We'll add... Okay, how about, like, we'll compromise and I'll do, like, a lavender. Carrie, is that acceptable? Is Let this, me know in the comments. Is this acceptable? You have five seconds. Five, four, three, two. Well, mm-hmm. she says I'll live, so... Nikki Miller says, hey guys. Hey, Nikki Miller. Kimber says, I like how she, I love uh, how she's turning out. Right, she's proud. Art Therapy with Mama Megs says, been silently watching, so gorgeous. Oh, thank you. Thanks for speaking up. And then Noah says, if you're just joining, Kit Kimball is just your female cicada. Thank you, Noah. And yeah. then Kimber says, hey, Nikki. All right, so we've added a little bit of purple. It's very subtle. That's what it was missing. Very subtle though, because it's almost white. Maybe the veins on her thing. Maybe you should just shut your little pile. Fine! Shut your pretty little mouth, Genevieve. All right. I she says, thanks, sweets. I think we did it anyway. Except she was like, thanks, sweets. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> just kidding. All right, we did it. Good job, oh. Kimball. Here, let me take let, the... Wait, let me show the sparkle in the earrings. I don't, I don't know how to hold it. Wait, if I turn this off. Yeah, turn that off, Kimball. Because then I can... You know what you could do? You could turn that off. Yeah, wait, how do I... How do I live without how do I, you? How do I? How, how do, do I? I some, what have I done to deserve this? Yeah. Oh, okay, whatever. We really want. All right, let me just unplug this hot, hot camera that's burning my thumb. You want to know why? Because it's like 90 degrees up here. That's true. Here, Kimball. Sorry. Oh, oh, button's pressed. Here she is, Miss Okay, the bug. Wait, why is it on manual focus? There we go. I'm just looking over at the screen going, oh. <laughs> she looks so scary. It's funny. Campbell, look, another one for the fridge. For the death fridge. Nightmare material. Campbell, can you give us, like, when, when she calls, like, what it sounds like? Hello. I'm calling about your cause extended warranty. Now, that sounds like a messed up moaning myrtle. Mm. Uh-huh. <sighs> Acting. And scene. Okay, now you have to entertain people. Go. What? I was not prepared. Missy Lulu, I have to bring the comments up here so you, mm. I can't look. Oh, and also, let me show you. If you were not here, this is what the inspiration was. Nightmares. My nightmares. Today we were focusing on fears, and it didn't help. I just feel even more scared that I've looked at them so long. Now I know what's going to be on me if they touch me. Great. Karen says, you guys are having so much fun. It's contagious. X... And then Missy Lulu says, perfect heart, face, smile. And then Karen says, can you do a craft room tour now that you're live? Sure. (laughs) Like, (laughs) right now? Dolores says, Kimball and Rocky Sunday night is never boring. Oh, that's sweet. All right, craft room tour, Kimball. Let's get on it. Welcome to my craft room, Kimball's Corner. Welcome to Kimball's craft room tour. So it's literally a corner. Here, I'm going to flip it back over here. Let's focus on what's important. Okay, Campbell, got it. No, really. Um, so Wait, I, have call- bring, I have to bring the phone up so I can comment as people are commenting. Oh my God, you are like commenting. a multitasker. You are so good at what you do. So basically, <laughs> I call it Kimball's Corner because it's like my little corner of the world. Wow, literally. that really explains things. Literally, it's a corner of the world. I, I, I assume you're me to, you were gesturing yes, that yes. way. Do I have to do like, over here, land the plane? Do you like the code we talked about? Like the code action? What was that? Did you I, lick your mouth? Like- what's the code yeah, so, okay, we'll start over here. We'll start over here. Okay, so, if you don't know, I'm addicted to 17 poster. I can't, like, reach too far, but oh yes, I see. Oh, my God, limits. Okay. A little snail. Okay. This is a computer that I'm scared to get back on, because if I do, I might start doing tons of digital art. Under here, we have bed sheets that we don't use and a painting <laughs> over here. She's judging us from below. She's like, that's how you're messing your Always. Got it. Over here, we have a cricket in pristine condition. This is not a Facebook marketplace ad. Can we move on? It will turn into sticker maker eventually. Sure, it will. Okay, great. These are more of the pigments that I need to turn to watercolors. Is that where you keep all the teal? (laughs) Yes. Okay. That's Um, where where he keeps the teal. These down here are all full journals. Like front. I mean, you have to open one and then just flip to a random page, and that's like how you have to do the rest of your art from now on. Okay, well, there you go. Inspiration. No, that was just that one, Kimball. I said you have to flip it open. Okay, moving on. Hmm. Anyway, Jenna's all open it. 
This is overflow of Jane Davenport products because I go overboard when Michaels was clearancing everything and spellbinders and anywhere else I could find those products. Now we have no reason to go to Michaels again. <laughs> Do you like... Kimber butter. says those cicada boots are made for walking. Girl. That's just what they'll do. This is when all of the butterfly books went on sale. At like Michaels. At clearance. So this is all butterfly books that I'm going to use for travel journals when we travel. That's a lot of traveling we have to do. Yep. Start saving your pennies. Oh, yeah. And come with me now. Great. The phone might die. Well, my cord's only so long, Kimber. Well, I'm you can really need to... Stay there. Keep okay. it dist. Okay, well... Um, and this camera. is what I have to hold my phone and look at comments. as Also, the camera might die because it's hot. And if it does, so long, farewell. So these are people ask me all the time where I learned to draw. I took high school drawing classes, but I mostly learned to draw from comic books and art books and just inspired by other artists. So that's what a lot of that is. There's a lot of toys. I love toys and cute things. Pusheen. I love cats. Okay. Bobblehead. Wait, open the bottom again. Let me see. I love my little pony. Okay. Got it. Because they're funny, and they have good stories to tell. Do they? Okay, great. So, yeah, and there's also some journals and art stuff down there. The most adorable doorstop you're ever going to find. Um, over here. <laughs> That's pretty cute. So, over here, more Jane stuff. <laughs> okay, so... I don't have a problem. Basically, what we're all learning is that Kimball definitely does not have a problem. Okay, great. No. Um, I bought all this Arteza stuff because it was like super inexpensive at the time. It was like a bulk thing. Haven't even opened that. I've only tried a couple and I was like, oh, it doesn't compare to my Jane stuff. Like it's good. It's fine. Whatever. But like, it's super shiny. Where'd you get the doorstop? The doorstop is from Amazon. Thank you. Yes, you're welcome. Okay. Moving on. Um, this is from a lovely person, a lovely viewer that's watching us right now. So um, it's camera. Yeah, it's Jenna. Got it. Got it. Uh, Basically, I'm all Jane paints. Y'all, I ain't lying when I say like I love her stuff. Like, it's not a lie. It's not a lie. Oh, this was like a brush cup that I messed up, so it's it stays there for now until I figure out what I'm gonna do with it. Got it. Okay. Alcohol. So you put alcohol in front of it. Well, oh, because right here, oh, Jane brush. Um, these are all alcohol inks in my little pusheen container. I play with them every now and then, but it's like whatever. <laughs> um, Jane paints and random sprays. Okay, got it. Matte medium, I never use. They, I ordered, I ordered some Jane paints, and then they, um, they were kind of broken in the case. Mm. So it was back when she was with American Crafts. So they sent me a replacement, but they don't make her stuff anymore. So they sent me like a bunch of random like matte medium and whatnot. I don't ever use it. I don't like do collagey stuff. Um, those are all empty journals. For the most part. That's just a mountain of creation waiting to happen. Like, okay, well. These are handmade journals. These are watercolor marker sketching journals. These are Jane journals, Illo sketchbook, uh, Arteza, a couple other random ones. I don't know. Whatever. I mean, I'll just focus on the pushing at the bottom with the little sailor hat. Thank you. You have a problem with me. Okay. Okay. What's happening? Where are you coming towards? These now? are all stamps. A lot of them are Jane. Okay. <laughs> these are squid inks because they are awesome inks and I love them. Okay, got it. Pusheen stamps, because why wouldn't I have those? You've definitely got a lot of use out of those. <laughs> um, this is like, oh my god, I'm realizing I really do have a problem. So here's a bunch of <laughs> Jane. <laughs> it's more Jane stuff. It's just, and if you go to Jane's website, you're going to see all the stuff there. We got some more Jane stamps, uh, some washi tapes. It's the girl I drew from the 1940s, maybe 1920s. I don't know. It's your smallest wood piece today. More wood art. More <gasps> this art. thing. This thing. Oh, y'all. Oh my god. Yes, thank you. Thank you. <laughs> oh, so good. I love that. For those really stressful days. Wallets. Wow. Just in case. I've really downsized. I really like this pink one. It was to help. It was for a good cause. And then this one is weird. It like flips open both ways. Mystery. Phone case covers. Phone case covers. Draw my own, print them out. Because I can't decide on one. Uh, washi tapes. These are journals that I'm currently working in and gifts from friends. Okay, got it. Uh, what else we got? Old phone. Ooh, oh, the camera's getting hot, Kimball. You better okay. wrap this lots up. Lots of markers, lots of stickers. Um, random pattern papers that I draw on. Under there, we have a tabletop easel. We have some brown clipboards, a cutting thing, a giant thing of Bristol paper. Over here, we have microns that I haven't touched in years because why do I need them anymore? Uh, Jane journals. 
layer cakes, pinpoint paint pens, story time paint pens, Funtin pens, LTQ pen, story time paint or story time or finishing line pens, chain watercolors. Oh, these are the ones I use all the time. Plus these ones go up there too. Those are there for emergencies only. This I use, I made that myself with Jane's pigments. Got it. Mermaid markers, obsessed. Mermaid markers, obsessed. Oh, mask from Venice. 17. Uh, Jane on my pegboard. Oh my God, the incredible inks. These are the OG incredible inks. They all have scents. They smell delicious. Um, Jane colored pencils, power pastels. Those are drama sticks. Campbell, you know what time it is? It's time to say goodbye. It is, because the camera's going to overheat. So go ahead okay. and hold that right there over Genevieve, and then give us the sign Genevieve, out. Actually, if not... you could just give us the um, like her call whenever she calls people. Her call's like... <laughs> I'm a cicada. <laughs> I call 